showing you guys my actual physique in like a video form. Um, so right now I'm going to do a quick little physique update. I just got back from the gym. Um, this morning I weighed in at 129 pounds I believe which is like two pounds up from what I've been weighing lately but that is okay. I had a tail top last night so that's probably why. So yeah here's just a little um, physique update and showing you like where I'm at with my progress. I'm trying to like lean out a little bit and then grow. I'm trying to like lean and grow at the same time which is Everyone, it's stupid, like you're not supposed to do that. But um, I'm kind of trying to. <laughs> so here, let me show you. definitely still have quite a bit of work to do. I definitely want to grow my glutes more and my shoulders. But um, right now my, my goal is to be more of like a shredded look. And then over the summer or over this, um, the holiday season when I'm eating a lot of food, I will be lifting much heavier and hopefully building my glutes um, and my shoulders a little bit more. But that is that. And I have a surprise for you. Look who is here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, hello! Oh, this is Jack Jack. And I named him Jack Jack because of the little mouse from Cinderella whose name is Jack Jack. And I think he looks just like him and he's my favorite character. So I think he's hungry. I'm gonna go feed him. So hope you guys enjoy the video and I will see you in the next one. So for tonight's dinner, I've decided to make a uh, spaghetti squash with marinara sauce and meatballs and I am super excited because I've been craving pasta and spaghetti squash is just like um, it's a certain type of squash that you can bake and shred into spaghetti so um, I'm gonna make that tonight and I will show you how to do it so we're at the neighborhood Walmart right now which is like the semi-classic sort semi-classy sort of decent Walmart and I'm going to pick that up and we're gonna go back to the house and make it So here is my spaghetti squash, and apparently you are supposed to cut it this way with like, this is my broken knife, but a uh, paring knife, and it's actually pretty easy, so if you cut all the way around, um, then you can pop it open and scoop the seeds up. So here it is cut in half, and now I'm just going to scoop out the seeds. This is very much like pumpkin carving, and I am quite in the season for this, so. Hooray. Never never act wild. Very low key on the profile. Catching feelings is it all. Let me show you how it goes. Love's the worst pain. Just gonna throw away these seeds. And then. I'm following a Pinterest recipe, so let's go see what it says. How to cook a spaghetti squash. Um, where are we at? There we go. So then it says bake face down on a cookie tray or a baking pan for 60 to 70 minutes at 350. I don't want to wait that long, so I'm going to do four, 400 for hopefully like 40 minutes. I don't remember what I did last time, but I remember that I needed to cook it a little bit longer 
last time. So we will see how this works. Here we go. All right, baking pan. Hey, uh, ooh, come here, get up there. This little monster, stay. I'm so scared he's gonna like jump inside the oven. Oh my gosh. We tried to make him not go on the counters, but that didn't work very well, did it? Did it, did it, did it. Ooh, this is so cute, so cute. Ooh, he's kinda hurting today. So he got hurt, he cut his face. But he'll be okay. Yeah. Won't you, Jack Jack? Mm hmm. Yes. <laughs> okay, where am I going in here? Oh, now he wants the camera. <laughs> here, get down. Okay. Um, so, I'm also gonna make, what are they called? Meatballs. Turkey meatballs. And I'll show you how to do that in a second. Alright, for the meatballs, we're starting with two pounds of turkey, uh, the ground turkey 93.7. I have some cut up onions over here and in here already I've put in two eggs. Um, I'm also going to add blah, 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 a little bit of oats and then Jack Jack is going to sabotage everything. <laughs> Don't, nope, you can't have that, can't have that, there you go. So here are the oats, I'm going to put in approximately like a quarter of a cup but I need two hands to do that, so one second. Okay. How are you supposed to do this? Oh my gosh, what a mess. Okay, so I put in like a third of a cup here. Maybe a little more. Whatever. And the oats um, substitute for breadcrumbs. So you can do those if you want to, but this is just like lower carb. And then I'm also gonna put in some seasoning. So I have garlic pepper, or garlic garlic um, powder, onion powder, pepper and salt. I'm about to bag it up. I like the way you work it. 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 So I totally forgot to say and do this, but before you put the um, spaghetti squash in the oven, you're supposed to put like olive oil, salt, and pepper on there. So I just took it out and it has a great texture and consistency. So I'm just going to put season it now, whatever, no big deal. I have my um, meatballs cooking, I have some in here and then some just in the oven there to, because I have a lot. And then here's my little spaghetti sauce. I use the ragu garden chunky something or other. And I added some spices like some Italian seasoning, garlic, and onion pepper. Onion, onion powder. Why do I keep saying pepper? I don't know. So yeah, that's about it. I'm really hungry and very tired and I cannot wait to eat. Update. Also, while I was taking the groceries out of my car, I had a bottle of red wine in there and I freaking drop it. And it broke all in my garage. So not only did I have to clean up red wine everywhere, but also I could not even drink it. So, <laughs> a little upset. Normally I would put a little bit in the sauce too. Just become double bummer. I'm not like an alcoholic, but I love red wine when I'm drinking, when I'm eating spaghetti and I was like so excited for it. So I guess I could have gone back to the store to get some, but um, I really didn't feel like it. I was kind of tired. And I had already gone back to the store again. What is he doing? He's just little Mr. Helper. Little Mr. Helper, are you? Hmm. Yes, you are. Oh my goodness. So I've already started the first one here. This is what it kind of looks like. This is a little bit mushier than what I normally would have, but it's, I think it's because I forgot to put in olive oil when I cooked it. 
And then this is just how you do it. You go like this and you shred. It's very, very easy. Boom! Spaghetti squash! Timer off. So yeah, there we go. So excited. <laughs> just almost dropped my camera. Here is the final result. I do think I kind of overcooked this spaghetti squash. Because last time it was a little bit thinner or a little more stringy. But that's okay. Tastes great. Here's Jack Jack and watching Fixer Upper. It's a nice night. Thank you so much guys for watching this video. As always, if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up because that helps my channel grow. And subscribe if you've not done that already. Um, you can also add me on Instagram at the Barbell Blondie if you'd like to see more of my posts. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.